afternoon, I'm Pamela Van Meer, Kawartha 411 News, and this is your 5 at 530. Your top news headlines from in and around the city of Kawartha Lakes for Tuesday, August 25th, sponsored by Income Tax Plus in Lindsay, family owned and operated since 1988. The driver was injured when a gravel truck rolled into the ditch on Porter Road this morning. Police say it happened just after 7 o'clock when officers responded to a single vehicle collision. The road was closed from Lifford Road to Highway 7A. On arrival at the scene, officers observed a gravel truck that had rolled over and come to rest in the ditch. The driver was extricated from the vehicle by fire services and then transported to a local area hospital with minor injuries. The road was closed for hours for the investigation. A local artist has painted over graffiti and racist remarks under the Iron Train Bridge in Lindsay. His name is Steve and he received permission from the city to paint a mural under the bridge. The material is costing $400. The city pitched in for that according to Steve and Steve is donating his time and effort to paint the mural. The local mural that we're working on and uh, just want to give a shout out to Ryan Smith that works at uh, the city of Fort Lake. And uh, Thank you for giving me permission and working with me on this and uh, hopefully we have lots more in the future. The Kawartha Lakes Police Service is investigating two separate thefts involving tools and a welder in the Lindsay area. Police say on the night of August 23rd to the 24th, a Miller Big Blue 500 welder on a small trailer was parked in a locked compound on Fleetwood Road. The fence was cut and the trailer and welder were taken out through the hole according to police. And they're also investigating a theft from a St. David Street business on the weekend of August 21st to the 24th. A work van and trailer parked outside the business were entered and a large quantity of construction tools were stolen. Anyone with information is asked to contact Kawartha Lakes Police at 705-324-5252 or Crime Stoppers. We are always looking for news, so if you are out and about in the city of Kawartha Lakes and you see breaking news happening, we want to hear about it. You can send us an email to info at kawartha411.ca or you can find us on Facebook, Twitter and on Instagram. It's time now to take a look at your weather. Our weather is sponsored by Team Brad Bird, Mincom Plus Realty and Lindsay, a team that gets your home sold. For tonight, we're looking at a 30% chance of showers early this evening. On Wednesday, increasing cloudiness with a high of 23, but feeling like 26 with the Humidex and a low down to 16 overnight. On Thursday, cloudy with a 60% chance of showers, a high of 27 and a low of 17 throughout the night. And Friday, a mix of sun and cloud with a 60% chance of showers, a high of 23 and a low of 15 throughout the night. Our weather shot today is from Garnet Grand Park in Fenland Falls. That's your weather sponsored by Team Brad Bird, Min Complex Realty in Lindsay. That's your news for Tuesday, August 25th. For a look at all of the day's news in depth, you can go to our website, kawartha411.ca. Thank you so much for watching, everyone. If you appreciate this news, please share it with your friends. Have a great night. We'll see you tomorrow.